Over the years, Boston Dynamics has taught its slew of robots to do a lot of things. They'll pick and sort packages onto pallets, they'll clamber around in the snow, they'll even bop around to Uptown Funk if watching a robot dog twerk is somehow your thing. This time though, Boston Dynamics has coaxed one of its bipedal Atlas robots to do some gymnastics. Yep, this thing isn't gonna win any awards for its floor routine, but I mean, you just have to What's more important here is how Boston Dynamics actually made this happen. Rather than painstakingly program a series of granular actions that add up to a larger routine, Boston Dynamics says it's using an optimization algorithm that matches high-level descriptions of actions into reference motions that the Atlas could feasibly manage. From there, the company uses a model predictive controller that helps to seamlessly stitch those discrete actions into a routine that a decently talented child could probably pull off. Do I sound bitter? I sound bitter. I was always that kid who like dreaded doing gymnastics in elementary school because I could never figure out how to do a cartwheel. Anyway, the approach Boston Dynamics took here meant that creating this routine didn't require nearly as much time as it would have in the old days. The process isn't quite as straightforward as that though, since the company admits that the Atlas will still flub something here and there about 20% of the time. Even so, there is something to be said for the level of grace on display here. It all feels surprisingly human. And even though watching a robot effortlessly move between these different actions kind of feels like a stunt, it's nothing if not a demonstration of how far the Atlas has come. It wasn't that long ago that this thing could barely walk. Now it's clearly showing that it can fall while maintaining control of itself, and the level of dexterity on display here will definitely come in handy for the sorts of search and rescue missions the Atlas was originally designed for. It might not be long before one of these things comes racing into a disaster zone to save some lives, and Thank you.